Many of us find ourselves as part of the sandwich generation, raising our children while also caring for our aging parents or grandparents. When an older person in our lives is diagnosed with a disease that steals their memory, developing a care plan can become even more challenging. As Terry recently discovered, the great team at Maple Creek provides an incredible solution. one's age, sometimes health issues can make you concerned about their living environment, especially when we're talking about memory issues. So we're here at the Woods Maple Creek with Elliot Talon. You are the marketing director. And Elliot, tell me exactly what you do here. What kind of an environment do you provide for people who have those memory loss issues? Yeah, well, Maple Creek offers a lot of different services for all types of seniors, but we're really focused on providing special care for people with memory concerns. Um, we have two specialized programs. Right now we're at the Woods, which is an assisted living program, and um, we really try to focus on a lot of the rec therapy activities that people can do for engaging on different levels, um, meeting people at their cognitive abilities. Um, in the past, a lot of times it would be focused on, um, you know, really making people do things that maybe they weren't capable of. So we really focus on people's abilities and strengths and use those um, to help make their days better. Actually, it's been um, a blessing in disguise. Um, it's provided not only me, my sister, and our family um, peace of mind, but also my mom uh, peace of mind. She was home alone. She was, she was starting to get scared. Um, and very lonely, where here she can be very social. So not only is it a peace of mind, we know that she's getting great care. Um, and they're also keeping her very physical, and um, they're also giving her some cognitive stimuli, which is very important. And you work in conjunction with a lot of advanced research because the kinds of therapies that you utilize here are proven to really be beneficial. Yeah, so a few of the um, research models that we use um, for our rec therapy use what's called Montessori-based um, therapeutic recreation, um, which really, again, utilizes people's strengths and abilities. Um, we also use a couple through our, our nursing department that have been researched very strongly, the unmet needs model of care, as well as it's called the seven core competencies of dementia care. Um, so that's what we've kind of founded all of our memory care programming on, um, both here at the Woods and in the Harbor, which is in our skilled nursing. Rooted in faith. Yes. And yes. great quality Absolutely. patient care. Um, we're, a, we're an organization of Lutheran Social Services of Michigan, and so we are a faith-based um, company that really wants to, um, our mission is to serve people as the expression of the love of Christ. And what better way to do that than to care for somebody who um, really can't do that for themselves. Really, Maple Creek has provided us uh, a peace of mind, but also we're getting very kind, compassionate, loving care. There's so many times where I walk in and I see one of the um, Maple Creek ladies hugging my mom, consoling her, talking to her. They call her by her name. If you put yourself in um, my mom's shoes or anyone suffering from a memory disorder, they can't remember what they did this morning. My mom specifically cannot remember what she did a minute ago. So if you put yourself into her shoes, just think about that. That's a very scary, very lonely mind state. It just makes me feel so much better that I can't be with my mom 24-7, but there are other people giving her the love that she deserves. Joyce Bond is with the Alzheimer's Association, and you really work to help organizations like Maple Creek. We do. We work with Maple Creek along with a lot of the other community organizations, both uh, residential and long-term care, as well as caregivers and persons in the early stages of dementia within the community through the number of programs and services that we provide all around the West Michigan area. You support research, you help we with do. these programs, and you rely on funding. And there's a huge event coming up people can help out with. There's a great event coming up on September 13th out at Millennium Park is our um, signature event, which is our walk to end Alzheimer's. It's a wonderful event. Um, we have over a thousand people that come out to that event and it's very positive and empowering so we hope everyone can join us. I'll be there. Good. That day. <laughs> I love that. And we hope you'll be there too and of course you can rely on the Alzheimer's Association and the woods at Maple Creek. Maple Creek would love to encourage 
everyone to consider coming out to take part in the upcoming walk to end Alzheimer's disease. Terry, as she said, will be there. The event is happening on Saturday, September 13th at Millennium Park. Registration starts at 9 a.m. with a ceremony at 10. Then the walk steps off just a few minutes later. You can register on their website, alz.org. Or get help with your questions about this disease anytime by calling their toll-free helpline. The folks at Maple Creek are also available to share more about their living environment and will happily offer you a tour anytime you want. Just give them a call or go online to learn more about them and the team at Lutheran Social Services of Michigan. Don't go away. We'll be right back with Maury West. That's West.